Hey, hello, everyone. How are you guys doing? I'm still not totally convinced on that intro, but... It's alright. It works. It plays videos. It's kind of rocking. Not as good as the original song. But, uh, you know. Anyway, how are you guys doing? I think it's uh, time to play some Soma, right? This Saturday, I think we're going to do uh, quite a few things. We're not just going to do uh, this or just SCP, though SCP will be streamed. I think, uh, I think I'm going to play most of those really bad horror games this Saturday. So that'll be Saturday, unless if we're doing Solar or Pulsar. Pulsar, that's the name of the game. Um, I loaded the game up prior to uh, starting stream because I timed it, and it takes about 11 minutes. Um, it's like 10 to 11 minutes. So I'm just going to go ahead and uh, flip over there. And that stopped awkwardly. Whatever. Spooky. Um, all right, that should be fine. Hi, how are you doing? All right. So I loaded up the game because the load time for this shit is awful. Um, but otherwise, it's a pretty good game. Wow, that's loud. Okay. So what we were doing last time was uh, trying to convince this guy whose mind has been trapped inside of this little brick thing here that um, we are his girlfriend. So that way he will give us the passcode to go into something. I forget what we were doing, to be honest. That's why I kind of positioned myself here. We have to get some other location. So we're gonna go back to his, um, his room. His name is Juan Brandon. Juan Brandon. Juan Brandon. Juan Brandon. That seems like it's more open than it was a minute ago. I recall that being a lot less open last time I played this. I haven't played Bla Battlefront yet. I, I do have to get, um, what is the name of that? Uh, Origin? I don't really want to install Origin. Unlike Steam, like, Origin and Uplay don't really have the, uh, the same appeal for me. Catherine Goya. I think he's back here, isn't he? I wonder what the real Simon would have thought if he knew about me. What do you mean? You do know about yourself. No, I, I mean the real Simon. The human Simon. Going by your reactions, I'd say you'd be pretty upset. I like how they have just, like, random banter back and forth. I'm hoping that I can get some information off one of these, like, on a place that I could be like, Oh, we're here. Doing this thing. Because every time we boot up the system, he, uh, he freaks out a little bit. Um, it's probably going to be some digital information. Um... It's actually kind of choppy today. We've tried all the different um, places to send him, and none of those work, but it looks like there's another place we could send him if we knew it, but we don't. So. Game's still acting a little choppy. I'm not sure what that's about. Maybe there's something. If I have to go to this much trouble to find whatever I'm looking for, it's probably not there. Um, like, they wouldn't hide something behind something, right? I've been doing good. I've been having fun, yeah. Um, will this tell us anything useful? Not particularly. Okay. Are these things I need to look at? Wish you'd tell me something about that guy. Like, we really don't know anything about him. Also, everyone has those hand cranking weights. I've heard guitar players, like really fast guitar players, like to use them in order to get their finger speed and strength up. That only helps to a certain degree. Uh, I don't know what, what, what are we doing then? Um, Who's girl whose name I can't remember. Let's see if we can get a, her to maybe tell me. That wasn't so bad. It's 
sure am I really gonna be worked up, bastard? What happened to the room? No, we would expect them, am I right? Alice, where are we? This is the Ark. However, we have a problem. Oh, that seems to be working. What? What's happening? Brandon, we need the new security cipher. You're lying. You're not Alice. What did you do to her? What's going on here? Why are you doing this? Yeah. For God's sake. Uh, we're missing some piece of information. We need to make it look like the Ark. What is this? Oop. Maybe there's another one of these things we can get. I mean, I guess plug this back in. An objective screen would help, but it would kind of take away from, like, the immersion of this game, but, uh, I don't know what I need to be doing right now. Because none of these help. I'm gonna run a few more just to make her say something. Yeah, see, I'm missing some piece of information. You're lying. This is a trick. Mr. Wong, I need you to calm down. This is fucking cold using Alice like that. Get out of my face. Calm down. I just need the cipher. I'm not giving you anything. Take me back to Theta now. I'm not having any more of your bullshit. This setup won't work. We need something else. Yeah, I got that. I just don't know, uh... Do you have suggestions on what I can do about that? Maybe there's a separate... Okay. Is this it? No, we've seen this one, haven't we? Uh, Strasky, come in. I need help in the lab. The scan room. Maybe we'll see something if we have the lights on. Wait, what is this? Um, test environments. Okay, maybe I can, uh, yeah, hold on. Okay, I think if I take this thing, this is the one that has all the environments saved on it. We might be able to get some, there we go. That's what I was looking for. Okay. Um. Okay. Um. With pilot sit for better continuation. We'll copy that over. Uh, beach we've already got. Uh, I don't know what this is. Reconstructed by WoW, do not use. Okay. Uh, okay. Okay. Uh, it's got to be the scan room then. I mean, that would make sense. All right. How do I eject the disk safely? I guess I'll just take it out like I normally do with the USB drive. Um. Okay. And we load this thing in. Scan room. Alice module. And hopefully this works. That wasn't so bad. This room I really got me worked up. 
bastard. Well, that was well, your death. I think it was I guess I had it coming. About Strohmeyer. He said he needed a new site for ASAP. What should I tell him? It's all right. I can talk to him. Wait. Wait. Didn't Sean just tell you to take it easy? Don't worry, I'm not going to tell anyone. I do feel hungover. Okay. Okay. It's 1729 over 42, 12 over 407. Got it? No. Yeah, I got it. I'm sorry, Mr. DeLon. Brandon. Goodbye. No, wait. All right, well, I felt a little cold about that. We got what we need. Is that what we are? Simulation? Erase data? Yeah, but it shouldn't make any difference. You're still you. I'm not sure what to do with the data. You decide. We're not gonna erase him. Fuck that, dude. Someone else... Shut down. Exploited hard. Okay. Can I take it with me? It doesn't seem like I can. Just plug him back in. Okay. I've forgotten how to plug things in, apparently. Um, we'll just leave this here. Um. That door is still freaking me out. Like, why is there so much blood coming out from under it? Simon, we got it. We can get to the Dunbat now. Get back here. Okay. Nothing bad will happen at all. All on the way there or anything will be fine. It'll be okay. Chips can count as a hat if you need to eat your hat. Dunbat does sound like a, a Pokemon more than a... These things keep crinkling and gurgling at me. Which leads me to believe that any number of these red fleshy things is going to burst out and try and kill me. You know, the way that fleshy Bulbous' things do. I mean, there's a healing pod here. Why is there a healing pod here? There's nothing behind Catherine, me. Catherine, couldn't we just have extracted the cipher from Brandon's data somehow? It's so cruel bringing him back like we did. No, that's impossible. Memories don't work like that. Let's just hope it was worth it. Apparently that's how black magic works. Like necromancy and that kind of thing. You basically, like, it's under the assumption that ghosts know everything. And so you just bring them back to life, and then you torture them until there they give you information. Just warming up the That's how black course. magic works. Spent collecting dust for months, so it might need a minute. All right, I don't totally trust this okay, procedure. That's, that's everything. Let's go ahead and huh? That's weird. Huh. Don't give me a huh. That's weird. What do you need me to do? Head inside the dock. The Omni Tool can open the door now and get into the Dunbat. Then plug me in, and I'll take us into the abyss. That sounds easy enough. good. It's not going to be easy. Also, she's got little, like, virusy things on her as well. Okay. I am totally unconvinced about the safety of anything I'm doing right now. All of this feels very unsafe and bad. There we go. Scan this shit up. There we go. Okay. I wish you had been more specific about what was weird. Oh. Is this the Dunbat? What's... What the fuck is this? Yeah, I don't know what I'm messing with here.
I don't know. I'm not entirely sure what I need to do to turn that. Doesn't seem like I'm allowed to yet. Okay. Um. Something tells me that she's infected. Warning, watch out for moving doors, okay? Is any of this button? I mean, there have been like zombie things downstairs. Not sure why I didn't lock the door behind me. It wasn't an option is mainly the reason. Uh, there's a thing up there. Maybe that's where I need to go. Some of this game is figuring out exactly what it's asking of me, but it's pretty clear. I mean, if you start being too dumb, she starts getting on your case about it. Um, eh. I think I can almost reach it. Up. Oh. Ow! Fuck. Okay. Okay, there we go. Okay, well, it's not that. Um, there's the Dunbat. I think that's what that's supposed to be. There's no real turning those things. Hmm. All right, well. Because she's not plugged in, she can't tell me anything. Her existence is entirely based on whether or not she's plugged in or not. So she gets really freaked out anytime we unplug her. I'm gonna plug her back in and see what she says. Maybe she knows something about this situation. Yeah, acne is not the same thing as herpes. I don't think they're related at all. Um, all right, I'm clearly doing something wrong. Um, I'm just not entirely sure what yet. Oh, and that door works now. Okay, um, we need to do a thing with this. Probably, it's really the only thing that I've got an option to deal anything with. Um, which leads me to believe that I have to do something with it. I mean, this button up here, it works. Is there anywhere else we could wheel this ladder? Yeah, I think those lip swords you get are technically closer than acne. Um, wait, what is this? Is this a button? No, it's just a flashing doodad. Okay. Um, what's my favorite ice cream? There's this ice cream place called Amy's. It's local as far as I know. Um, it's good. Um, I usually get um, like Mexican vanilla with uh, white or what are they called? Vanilla Oreos. Okay. Do I like the gorillas? Yeah. Uh, they're good. I think Ima and um, Tilda like them more, but um, wait a minute. I'm just trying to get any sort of lead on what the fuck I'm supposed to be doing here. Um, I can't get it around that way. Can't get it around that way. I've tried uh, beer ice cream before. I got it when I was hanging out with uh, KY. It was uh, Guinness flavored. Kind of tastes like chocolate and coffee. She wants me to get in, but there's really not in to be had. Can I? 
Okay. Um... I'm being really dumb right now. It's been like a few days since I played this. So I don't really remember what I was supposed to be doing or how I was supposed to be getting in the thing. And, um, so yeah. I mean, I can't plug her back in. I feel like I need to move the ladder somewhere, but I don't know where. I probably have to move, because this doesn't go under here. It's gonna hit that. So I need to go somewhere else? Where can I get with this? Um, surely it doesn't expect me to just climb up there. That doesn't seem safe. Um, I mean, this game wouldn't be this game unless I did really dumb, unsafe things, so. probably be behind the ladder while I'm trying to push it rather than trying to pull it places. Um, there's not a whole lot I can do from up here. Why is there a button up that high on the wall? I don't know. It doesn't work though. Is that a button? I can kind of push it even though I'm standing on it, which is really awkward, but whatever. Um, At least chat's not frustrated because I'm doing stupid things. They, they, there's only one person in chat that knows actually what the puzzle's answer is. This room is a big tr- So this is not even where I need to be? Or, wait, what is this? Is this plug- Hold on. Yeah. Have you checked to see if it's fucking plugged in? Um... Let's try and not drop the thing. Oh, 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 there's not water below it, is there? Okay, there is. It's fine. Can we release it slowly? Please don't break it. Okay. Oh! Okay, that was weird. I guess I should have expected that the robot was uh, a human. That seems to be the the common trend in this game. I was trying to like do the the switch quickly, but this might be where I needed the ladder in the right spot. Go ahead and move this ladder over here. Where is it? Okay, well, at least I flipped all the switches. Alright. 
This has got to be the place I need to go. Um, she's going to be pretty mad at me that I didn't get in the Dunbat. Um, um, okay, there's a little bit of loading. Why do I feel... I'm pretty sure you're right. I feel like the tool is probably the real villain because she seems very apathetic about me killing people. Uh, so I'm going to probably do the opposite of what she says when she thinks to kill people. Uh, because uh, that seems like a bad thing. Okay, plan B. Oh, that's probably actually... A, no, that's probably not actually a map, is it? I was hoping it would be. There's a little achievement that popped up. And there's a straight line to A, and then there's this weird-ass line to B. Have to plug her back in, so that way she knows what's going on. Whenever it does a little brain symbol, it's saving, which usually means that I'm lagged out to the point that I can't move. Really hoping this doesn't break under me. Okay, it didn't. I think pretty much everyone that's here is a robot. Even the monsters are shorter robots. I hear something. Is that the Dunbat? I'm not sure what was the other direction, but this direction seems to have worked. There's screaming coming from this direction. Which leads me to believe that I'm probably going the right direction. It's a horror game after all. I don't see anything. But there's something here. Oh, it's one of those guys. Okay. Well, I'm not really sure what to do with the information I've got right now. Um, if I jump down there, there's no coming back up here. So I might want to go the other direction real quick. If I can. Just in case. I am also a robot. I'm a human-shaped robot. Probably. We have every reason to believe that I'm a robot because essentially I think I'm, um, the, the way I described it the other stream was, uh, that I appear to be just like the Unity Asset Store version of AI. I used to be a human being, but now people just base their AI off of me. Which I wouldn't base AI off of me. I'm a little bit too unpredictable and just not well put together, generally speaking. Uh, so I would I wouldn't do that. But the people at this research laboratory, for some reason, booted me up. Um, that really hasn't been explained yet. Why I've been booted up in the first place. Okay, and this leads us to a broken door. All right, so that meant nothing for us to crawl all this way. Hey, Archfile. <sighs> I had some caffeine a minute ago, but I just didn't sleep well last night. Yeah, it's something like that. It's like... All the basic stuff for how to make a brain work are kind of copy-pasted from my brain. Have you ever seen, like, example code? I guess that's what I am. Except for some reason, someone decided to run a Hello World program that someone else wrote. And yeah. Yeah, it'd be best to just avoid talking about plot if you've uh, already played this. 
No offense, just because we don't want to have spoilers. Alright, so we definitely have to go in here. What's this? Okay. It's a picture of a thing. I think that's that thing in the background. So whatever it is is supposed to be here. Oh. Like a Dremel or something. Um, and then there's this thing. Is this it? I don't know what the fuck that is. Uh, yeah, let's plug her back in. Hey. Huh? Wait, this isn't. Oh no! Wow, got to the dime bag before we did. Yeah, right? how did? Well, yeah. I was talking. That's rarely a good sign. Damn it! The dime bag was our best shot. I was really banking on this to work. Come on, we can't uh -huh. quit now. There's got to be another way. How do you think you did it? How did the team get the ark down the abyss in the first place? If they didn't use the dime bag. The only other way would be the climber at Omicron. It's like an elevator which supposedly reaches all the way down into the abyss. See, that seems really okay, unsafe. so we do that. We go to Omicron and take the elevator. Yeah. Okay. Sure. We'll just head over to Omicron and hope there's a power suit that fits you. You know, so you don't implode while in the abyss. That sounds good. That does sound useful. Alright, let's go then. Wait, what is this place? I don't fucking know. Seems to be a lot of information on the art here. There's a prototype and everything. Okay. Let's start it up. I want to see how it works. Maybe we can figure out how to get on the Ark. Oh. You didn't know how to get us on? How difficult could it be? Uh, I'm going to pause one second real quick. Hold on. Um, and then I'm going to close out of Skype. Um... I just remembered that I had Skype open because someone goes, this is really shitty quality for Skype. <sighs> Pew! Okay. The voice acting in this game I, has grown on me. I don't know as if it's gotten better. Okay. Uh, decided to finalize the arc with the scans we have. I'm sorry for all of you that didn't get a chance to scan yourself before the project was put on hold. It's been two months since I've added a skin, and I don't see how I'll be able to win back y'all's support. Uh, you all showed me when we first started the project. I'm sorry, I never meant for anyone to take their lives. It was never my intention to fool anyone. I was just trying to save something. Uh, apply intrasafe module, seal arc, ask for permission, brief them, take shuttle to Omicron, pick up power suits, Ride the climber into the abyss, regroup at Tau, head to the launch site, load the bullet, launch the arc. Okay? What does that tell you? Anything? Do you know anything now? Uh, arc locator. Yep, it's back at Omicron. Uh, wait, no, it's at Tau? Where? Okay, fine. Uh, okay. Recently you decided the arc project will become... Pathos's latest official commitment, the staff has been urged to carry on with their duties despite Earth's catastrophic condition. I think the art project is the most logical state towards saving mankind. It should be spend as much of our time and resources. Yeah, I agree with that. Uh, every passenger needs to be flushed with electromagnetism uh, using a pilot seat. These scans sessions are known to cause nausea and headaches, sometimes lasting up to three days. I think a temporary physical discomfort, no matter how severe, is a small price to save humanity. Alright, yeah. I mean, these are kind of... Um, loaded questions? Um, let's see. Ark is built to fit the uh, shot into space with the Omicron or Mega space gun. Technically survived for thousands of years, living off the light from our sun distant stars uh yeah um a uh, digitization of humanity is an opportunity to make a quantum leap in our own evolution people inside the arc will 
out of necessity be generated from existing gene code but be a lot altered to allow cosmetic changes easy ease aging and even prevent death i think we are at risk of losing our humanities if we rid ourselves of disease and mortality oh uh, maybe i mean how much of what you do is based on the time clock that you have on this earth you know There are only 58 people left alive to be stored in the Ark. A way to diversify and expand the population would be to introduce artificial intelligences that would in every way appear human, but with a childlike and naive sensibilities. Uh, as we continue to explore the nature of intelligence, we may find a way to make them smarter in the future. I think, the, I think even an inferior group of artificial people would benefit our society. That sounds like we're going to do some slavery, but I guess that's what computers are, so... I agree. All right. Okay. Uh, I shrunk. Oh, okay, cool. Uh, here's how your colleagues voted. Arc approval, uh, eternity among the stars, inferior companions, uh, pain for gain, artificial evolution. They disagreed with the artificial evolution thing. Okay. Um, good to know. Wonder if that connects up with the internet in some way. Probably not. It seems more story-based than really needing you to know. All right, that's all probably really informa good information that I need to remember, but I'm not going to uh, prick the arc with signal from transmitter. Power packs, Todd's. Okay. Uh. Okay. Wow, oh. that's so cool. It's the whole gang. Yeah. Crew photo? Really? Who are you saving this for? The world was dead. Thanks, Simon. I thought being an asshole wasn't invented until the 22nd century. Now I know better. It's basic. No, I mean, like, we, we were assholes back now. Um. What's this thing? That's just a compound examiner. Coster uses to investigate structural integrity in payload frameworks. Of course. Did you get inside it? I knew what you were made of. It would be a hell of a lot easier to figure out how to get you on the ark. I'm just gonna tell you right now that I think this is gonna wake up with me getting killed. On that note, I'm going to willingly get into this machine that will probably kill me. Go ahead and uh, load up the death machine for me, uh, hon. Tight fit. Can you reach the on switch? Am I spinning or is it spinning? The door hasn't moved. Should I be worried about radiation? I think we're beyond that. Yeah, I am not human, right? Interesting. You seem to be one with the diving suit you're wearing. Everything's meshed together. How's that gonna work with the suit we're picking up at Omicron? That looks um, very I'm skeleton. You should be able to wear them both. Imogen? Who's that? It looks like the basis for your body is one of my old colleagues. A standard cortex chip for robots, including the data reader and the ocu torch, has just been forced through the skull. What? Structure gel has fused the whole construction together. Amazing stuff. No, 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 no. Hold on. Back up. I'm one of your old colleagues? Well, your body is. Imogen Reed. That's disgusting. Hey, don't say that. She was my... She was nice to me. Anyway, Ooh, did you love her? Ooh. That means you can transfer your mind to the Ark with a pilot seat. So, I'm half a dead person. Yes, it makes sense. Think about it. All those simplistic minds we've run into, just reviving a dead person doesn't seem to work that well. A robot body seems to make people a bit unreliable. You are the best of both worlds. A sound mind and a sound body. I don't know about that. All right, cool. Now we know I'm made out of. I am a dude inside of a woman's body that is actually a robot that has been dead for a hundred years. Good, good. Makes total sense. I'm all things. If you tell me I'm a plant next, swear to God. All right. Um. Alright. 
So do I take you with you, me now? Start an arc simulation. I want to see how it works. Oh. Um. Boy, howdy! I don't understand what the fuck that means. Um. What am I plugging this into? Um. I haven't plugged anything in. Oh, I need to plug this in. Okay. Ninety-eight six terabytes? A hundred years into the future and that's all they've got? Oh, that's how much of it's corrupted. Oh, all right. Um Oh wait, what did I do? Um Did I do it? What the fuck am I trying to do? Oh, I probably need some of these things. Okay, I need daylight. I need Soma. Also, it feels like my computer's kind of chugging along today. Um, uh, Soma? Okay, so I need things. Okay, that's too much. Water needed? Okay, I don't need the water anymore. I guess we're at the lake. Uh, maybe, uh, just basically trying to figure out what I can and cannot get away with having. Cabin? I need water of some sort? So I can only have a boat if I have water. I need to load all the assets for the scene. Yeah. But I also need enough space. I can't try it out. It won't let me. I have to have only certain things. Uh, Alright, I don't need the boat. Heat is needed. So is interface. All these things are essential. Uh, let's see. I took out the clouds. How about river, maybe? Maybe one of these other environments would be better.
Okay, let's just remove everything. Start over. We've done this wrong. Okay. We got nothing. It needs that. It needs this. We need... Some sort of light. Uh, the moon is less weight. Um, unless if I do, like, maybe a cabin. Does that count? No. There's still gonna be light. Okay. Um, we'll worry about the water in a minute. Um, because there are multiple answers to the water question. Um, that's just something I've gotta have. Yeah, this is essentially like configuring uh, Minecraft mods without um, Oops, that's not it. <sighs> Fuck. Alright, um River weighs more, but I don't need something else. Okay. Oh, there we go. I got it. God damn. Try loading a dummy scan. Shouldn't be that difficult. Okay. I just want to make sure I understand how the scan data is formulated before we start messing around with the real arc. No, that's fair. Run the simulation and then hit pause while the code is running. It'll give me a cross section of the process. Is that what you want? Is that it? Did I do it right? Is it right if I heal up? I feel like I'm probably hurt. Probably from jumping off the roof at that one point. So I'm gonna go fist the alien. Okay. I feel like that was fucking with my vision. What the hell are you doing? It helps with m me being it hurt. looks bad, but it makes me feel a lot better. It helps me focus. That's... I, I mean, that's the wow you're hooking up to. Well... I need it, okay? I wouldn't have made it this far without it. <sighs> Let's just keep going. Yeah, it's probably really bad for me. Are you doing it? Whatever it is that needs doing? Load a dummy and pause the simulation while it's active. Okay. Then we can run diagnostics and see how it operates. I did it wrong. I don't know what you want me to do. Try pausing it when the dummy is loaded. You need to catch it while it's being loaded. I, I understand what I need to do, but it goes really fast. No, try again. The dummy needs to be loaded when you pause. <sighs> My reaction time is not this good. Wait, hold on. Fuck. Can I... There we go. Admiring your own work. Yeah, seriously. What? Oh, right. A little bit arrogant. All right. Um, Are we done here? Can we go to Omicron and get my new suit now? Yeah, we should get going. Oh, Wanna right. Bring this arc as a backup. Now that wouldn't work. This is just a prototype. Good. I prefer to travel light. Let's yeah. go. Don't Not... forget to take me with you. Okay.
Okay. Boy, howdy. I really don't want to go any of these directions. But it doesn't look like I have a choice in the direction I go. Yeah, you can't get through doorways without her, so you can't go too far. Even though I'm pretty sure she's evil. I mean, the robots are pretty evil too. Oh. That probably s screwed up a scan. With me moving around. Hello? Okay. And we're loading. Okay. We haven't seen anything hostile in a while, which leads me to believe we pro- Speak of the devil. I don't know what the fuck that was, but we're gonna close the door behind us, cause fuck that. Um... Okay, there's probably something out. Sarah, how the hell are we gonna make sure the art makes it? Every launch is a crapshoot, you know that. I just wish these numbers looked better. What do you care? It's just a pack of data, right? Yeah. Just a pack of data. I don't understand how a vent goes through there. Like, it seems like the door slides up into that, so... How would that work? Like, wouldn't that mean that every time you use the door, you would cut off the vent? It's not like there are holes in the door or anything. There's another healing pod, just in case if I need it, which I probably will, because... Um... It's random screaming coming from the other room. There's lots of things I can touch. It's behind that door. Whatever it is. It's in the conference room. Oh, glitched out there for a second. You all right, dude? Not so much. Um, boy, that doesn't look healthy. I think you're technically alive, aren't you? That's weird of you. I'm gonna sit in your lap and look on the computer. Uh, he's blinded himself, clogged up his insides with structural gel. Surprised if he'll, if he ever woke up from the coma. Um. Ba -ba -ba. She doesn't want to be here, but Strommeyer demands another evaluation. Trun is obstinate or dishonest. She'd just rather not speak if it can be avoided. She's a hard time dealing with people in general, including the doctors. Um. Yeah, don't drink structural gel. That seems like a good thing to say. Conrad is dead. He boiled his brain to a pulp with the 
W. Rim Master following the Arc Neuroscan. Clearly another continuity enthusiast killing himself. Okay. So everyone's killing themselves because of the whole, um, worry about, I don't know. Uh, having, because it's like, uh, she's probably got, like, the girl that's been speaking to me probably has some weird issues because she kept going on after she, uh, scanned herself. So she learned new things, she worked on new projects, and we're trying to figure out what she learned in that time. And, all right. I mean, okay. Kind of feel like I need to wash my hands now, but I guess that's not an option, so never mind. I really don't want to go into the room that clearly has something horrible in it. There's blood here. More blood. Chair. Shutting the door behind us, because fuck that. Is this me or a copy of me? This is a copy of me. I died about a hundred years ago, according to the audio files. Okay, so this stuff got out. There's definitely something in the vents. Okay. It's nearby. I've trapped myself. I hear you, Brandon. What do you got? Akers and his critters are ferocious. They pick up on every move. There's no way past them. Then we'll fight them. We got to get to the shuttle. And end up like shaking at us? No way. Listen, I'll create a distraction and pull them to me. Get the gang to the shuttle station. Wait, Brandon, what are you doing? Don't worry, Alice. All the um, you guys are safe. Just load up the shuttle. Okay. Are you sure about this? I don't plan to die today, sir. See you at the shuttle. Good. Welcome to the stream. There's a monster nearby. That's just a fire hydrant. I don't know where he went. That's mildly disconcerting. Okay. Um, ooh, that's probably a, okay, I need to get a thing before, but I do need to come back here. Okay. Why is that locked? Yeah, there's one room that's locked for some reason. Uh, dispatch, conference room, shuttle station, common area. Huge structure. Uh, excuse me. Huge structural gel leak has caused the WoW to seize control over the Dunbat, forced to quarantine to avoid further development. Last thing we need is another talking machine. Okay, well. Um, it looks like we're going to need something to plug in there. Um, all right. I, however, need to go to the bathroom. Uh, so what that means is that we're going to go back to this and I'm going to run 90 seconds worth of ads, go pee, get some water, and I'll be right back. See you in a minute.
Alright. Oh, we're getting to the solo in the song. <laughs> oh, it's so cheap. I love it. Welcome back, everyone. Um, yeah. This fucking intro. So, just, yeah. Alrighty. Anyway, I'm back. Uh... I should probably make a separate screen for BRB, but for the Halloween stuff, I don't have anything set up yet, so. Oh well. I'll get around to that at some point. I'm very much behind on schoolwork and homework and life stuff in general, you know. Laundry starting to pile up, that sort of thing. There's still. I see the vent is broken, meaning that we have a problem. Okay. Oh my god, that's horrifying. Okay, that's a weird thing for it to be showing. Yeah, I'm kind of um, reading some of the bits of it. Well, happy almost birthday then. All right, well, let's try going this way. All right, there's the, uh, wow. The, uh, computer cancer. Yeah, they're still using basic slides. They're even, they're even using, like, a slide projector. Like, we got PowerPoint. In the past. We're not even talking about the future. Um, I'm going to crouch around because there's still a thing in the vents, probably. Um, Alright, here is a thing. Security error. Insert connector chip. Uh, someone has tried to rig the door to open. Um, I don't see any dead bodies, so I guess it worked. Storm. Brand, where are you? Got out of hand. I'm in sector RD4. Oh shit, there it is. Yeah, I'm stuck in a thing. Oh my god, that freaked me out, I gotta say. Safe. Take the shuttle, go to Omicron. God damn it, Warren. You just had to be the hero, you bastard. Good luck, sir. Tell Alice I love her. Oh, God. Luckily, uh... He didn't notice me? Something not hooked up right. Yeah, no shit. Hi. Bail! We're running. Shit, 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 shit. Shit, 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 shit. Okay. 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 Uh, fuck. Uh, fuck. I think he got me. Uh. 
he's still nearby. Maybe if I just stand totally still, he'll leave me alone. Did he hit me? No, he's still coming for me. No, wait. He's not? Can he only... Since based on sound? So me running around the hallways like an idiot. Okay. Okay. That's why he didn't attack me a minute ago. Okay. Uh, we need a security override chip. I'm not sure where I'd get one of those. Um, I like, one of the things that this game does good is it has a variety of enemy types. So it's not just like one thing is coming after you. So you have to kind of learn how everything works. They mostly seem to be blind and run off of either movement or sound. Uh, and I like that. Okay. Uh, let me see if there's maybe something that helps me. Storage locked. Wait. Okay. I could actually maybe lure him into a room and then lock it. So we're like here in security, I think. I wonder if I could lock him in a room. He probably would just go in the vents, wouldn't he? Conference room, examination room, doctor's office. <sighs> yeah. Yeah, sorry, Swin. It still is kind of freaked out about Lynx. What was the Link 2? Um, and I'm probably going to make it so that way Imager and YouTube aren't linkable. Um, I can't unlock the one door. I did not enable Imager. I would recommend not. Do I still check the, that email? Yes. Um... Okay, I haven't been in this room, so maybe there's a chip in here amongst the screaming dead bodies. Um, okay. Okay. Well, I got an idea. I'm not a huge fan of the idea, uh, but I'm pretty sure it's what I need to do. That's a custom message I made like a long time ago, so that's not accurate. I should probably change that. Okay.
Uh, we're trying to save humanity by getting on the Ark, which is basically like digital whatever. The cracked glass is how it tells you that you can break the glass in this game. Oh god. Please go somewhere else. He apparently can open doors. I don't think he knows that I'm here. He's blind. I had to break that window like that. I think he's got hands. I'm not going to look at him or else I start taking damage, so... God, there's so much clutter on the floor. Don't leave clutter around, because then if there's like a sound-based zombie... I don't know if he knows how to get in here. Oh God. Does he have like rigor mortis around this thing? Oh, it's Brandon Wan, this guy. This is the guy that we were tricking earlier into thinking that, like, whatever. I'm sorry about before, Brandon. I'm sorry we couldn't let you rest in peace. Congrat. Okay, that's just fucked up. Um, that's Brandon. That's the guy that we were messing with before, but he's alive now. Um, we could push him? Oh, no, we can touch him to learn things. You will get me, motherfuckers! You hear me? What is that dangling there? It's just a, a roof light. Okay. Is he outside? He's nearby. I'm gonna back off for a second. This game doesn't do screamers or jump scares. Can he open that locked door? I don't think so. Well, I mean... Clearly, he can get in here somehow. Um, else Brandon would be alive. Oh, thanks for the loading thing right as I'm jumping. He killed himself. It's possible. I'm, uh, I'm a little unsure of where I'm going to land. Do you have exceptionally long loading times, EZD? Um, because that has been my experience with this game so far. Now what? I need to format the chip? Okay. 
He's coming because he heard me messing around with the door. I'm gonna try and not look at him. Hopefully he'll just go away. Alright, fuck it. Nope. Ah, shit. Security office, security office. Okay, good. Okay. Okay. So fast. I locked myself in, that was the point. I don't want him to get in here and fuck with me. Because he's coming, isn't he? I'm gonna have to go heal myself in a second. How am I still alive? The game basically works off of a, a two-hit system that you get hit and then the monster teleports away from you. So that way you have another chance. It's it's a little bit gamey, but it's good. The downside is that you're in pain. Wait a minute, if I lock a door, will he go to that door? Probably, right? Because it'll make a shit ton of sound. He always freaks out whenever I open a door. So if I like... I think I'm, I'm, I think I'm having a smart. No, hold on, he's back. Trying to get him to go away. Okay, he's off. Oh God, okay. Oh, 
Uh, with the exception of the monster that doesn't like it when you look at it. How do you heal yourself? Is it locked in? See ya, dude. This is a stressful monster. Cause he won't leave me the fuck alone, and I'm already hurt. And I can't see him. Where, where the fuck is he? Oh, that's a good point. If I throw stuff around, I'm locked in here, so he can't get to me, so... What does this say? Checklist. Survive the Ark Project. Stop people from killing themselves. Send off C and the team. Keep people safe. Enjoy the rest of Armageddon. It's, uh... That seems like stuff you would remember. Nope, he's still wandering around. Let's open up some doors for him. Should probably stop making sound so he goes away. What does this say? Uh... Check and seal doors? Move downstairs, shuttle to Omicron. Acres is not alone. Least proxy creatures. Okay. Okay, it's just like, uh, Lansky has a question mark next to his name. Oh, will you fuck off? We can't progress the game until you do. I mean, you can't even see me. You don't even know that I'm here. He's just right there next to the door. Fuck off already, dude. Let me, um... There's a door on the other side of, uh... the building. Actually, I should probably keep that up, just in case. Will you fuck off already? Like, seriously, dude, come on. Me and Tolda thought about buying haunted houses. Oh? I think he just realized that I locked him in.
Uh, I plan on celebrating Halloween by playing spooky games like this. I'm kind of already celebrating. Wait, is he out in the hall again? You know what? I'm just going to run for it. I'm getting tired of doing this. Probably go heal. Sounds like it's choking on a Lego block. Nope, he's coming. Who knows if this will hurt me. There's an alien butthole here. That's getting more and more corrupting on my vision, which leads me to believe that's probably not good for me. Hoping that if I just stay still, he'll go away. I mean, how can you hear me or see me? Calm down, calm down. <sighs> My natural instinct is to start running, but that's not the right thing to do here. He doesn't see me. He can't see. We're okay, we're okay. Also, you'll okay the high five emote, so. Uh, that'll be done as soon as I get in touch with Brototop about the exacts of it. Once I see it again, I'll stop. And we'll just keep doing this until we get there. I've gone too far. Let's hope this works. missing something. What the fuck? Okay, just don't move. There has not been another Pulsar stream yet. Uh, that'll probably be this weekend. Maybe Sunday? But anyway, uh, the Olaf gif, or Olaf emote should be working soon. Uh, I set it up to go. Brototop, the person who did it, is, uh, doing a, uh, whatchamacallit? Don't move. What is it missing? Missing something. What is it? Oh. Tch. 
Don't move. The levers need to both be down, but I'm going to wait until he fucks off a little bit. Uh, we were thinking about doing it Tuesday, but uh, KY got his job. Um, and because KY got a job, he actually has like work on normal times. So the only day that we're going to really be able to do it is probably like Sunday or Saturday. So I would check back then. Make sure you're following the uh, Vine Sauce Twitter. And then um, Okay, I think I need to stand up. Okay. Okay, where are we trying to go? Maintenance? I just picked one randomly so that way we'd move. Okay, uh, I guess we're going to maintenance. Good. Oh no. Is it on the thing? I'm sorry, what? What ladder? Is that a ladder there? Whoop! Shit, I'm dead. I'm dead. And that was the end of the game. Me falling to my death in an elevator shaft. That's gonna fall. Okay. Oh, good! This looks like a friendly place. Yeah. No, I'm not too terribly encouraged to explore this area. Hopefully that asshole doesn't know how to use the stairs. Of course. Oh, fuck. What? I wasn't moving. Remember the note you read about proxies? Okay. I think that was our first full death. There were three proxies. Ah, good. Good. And there are three floors to the building. Good. <sighs> Where am I at? Um, Don't move. It's okay. Oh, okay. What? It's over now. Relax. No, this is not real. Ashley? I'm back in my apartment? Hanging out, know, like couples do. We're not. You don't want me? Yes. What the fuck? So was that not actually me dying, or...? What is hap- Oh, am I stuck to the wall now? Oh, God. Okay.
Okay. Okay. Okay. So, was that a scripted death? Was that supposed to happen? Or is this game just functionally well made enough that it... I mean, I can't go in that door anymore. I feel like that death was scripted, so I feel good about having had that experience. Um, okay, that door is available. There's also this thing. Um, which I don't seem to be able to plug her into. Oh, God. You're not doing well. Wait, what? Okay. Yeah, that made me feel like I fucked up, and I was like, alright, how can I do this better? And the game loads in. Okay. Just ignore the dead bodies. It freaks me out to look at them. I'm getting some weird texture stuff going on. Oh, God. Of all of the things that I wanted to have happen, um, this was none of them. Oh, good. Oh, I see another one of them. Where are you? It's okay, Mr. Manuel. All the Vine streamers check out the art, so if you see something that's... Oh God, please just go away. I haven't touched an alien butthole recently. This game is Soma. It is uh, made by the same people who did Amnesia. So, it has a lot of comparisons to Amnesia. Which I'm gonna play after I get done with this. Um, that's the next game on the list. That is a proxy? They're blind, but have really good hearing. Coming around to my side here. The problem is that if I move, then he hears my footsteps. He doesn't see me. Just keep calm. Moving will freak it out, so I gotta wait until it goes all the way around. This doesn't help me any. This does not help me any at all. I don't have my graphics all the way up, so the texture quality looks kind of ass. 
gotta remind you guys, because I don't think I said it at the start of the stream, which is bad, because I think that's like FCC shit, uh, that I got this game from my network, who got it from the developer, so. I have to say that stuff, because like, I don't know. Otherwise, people get mad. And it's sort of illegal, I guess? I don't know, it depends. I'm not sure, so I'm gonna say it just in case if it is. Because it's the whole full disclosure thing. Like, did me getting this game for free affect my opinion of it and all that? Especially because I got it from the developer. Oh god, so we gotta open the rickety ass gate. Oh, it's locked though. I need like a bolt cutter or something. Let's just not mess with it right now. And it makes me feel better that I can use the flashlight. That kind of gives me information on where I need to be going. Um. I feel like I should probably go to that door over there. There's nothing I can do to this. Or a key. I just, for some reason I don't assume that I'm gonna be able to get into this easily, so. Uh, I just assume that I need bolt cutters, but probably not. Okay, it's coming for me. Okay. I wonder how they got these sound effects. This the alien butthole. I have a feeling that's corrupting me slowly. I feel like this game has gone from like, kind of not spooky to kind of spooky. Um, the load times are way brutal. Um, but it's a good game. I think fisting the aliens um, alerts them. You do spend half the game, like, crouched over. Did that open it? Doesn't really look like it, but... Jamming my fist into the thing heals me. But also it's the thing that creates all these monsters. So there's a chance that me doing that is going to have some bad effect. I don't know if this game has multiple endings. Uh, Easy D will have to tell me if I get a different ending than him. That'll be something. That'll be one way of us telling. By opening that door, I, I definitely alerted it to where I was, but... I also get more cracks on my screen.
Yeah, I don't want to know yet, but I'm just saying. Hey, Marks. Which way is he coming from? Hoping that'll bring him over to the wrong side. He's close. Is he right there? I feel like he is. Yeah, he is. Good. Perfect. I got it alerted to the wrong side, so that way I could go out this side without having to worry about it. I baited it to the wrong side of the vent. Wait, is it? There's another one. I don't know how this one opens doors. It doesn't seem like it should be able to. But I'm gonna assume that it can and just kind of work around that. Another healing thing, in case if I need to fist the thing. Okay. If they can't see you and you can just stand still because you have to do stuff, like, every time I open a door, it freaks him out. So I have to just kind of be cautious. It's, it's not too bad, but also if they get too close to me, I start to freak out and then I'll make sound, even though I'm not moving. Probably. I at least start to freak out. this room. Guess it's just a hidey hole. Is he coming for me? Okay, yes. Oh god. Sorry, whenever I stream stealth games, or I guess horror games as well, or just play them, I get really, really quiet, because I feel like the game can hear me. Also seems like there are certain places you don't want to stop, like in that goop is probably not a good idea. I'm getting corrupted too much by it. I mean, I got placed in one earlier. I guess that's what it does, is it doesn't straight up just break your neck or anything. It just puts you in the goop, so that way it can fuel it, maybe? Okay, let's bait it to the other side. 
I would be eager to hear what game that is if you know Easy D. Because that would be awful for streaming, but really cool. Left for Dead had that? What? Wasn't that an option on Alien Isolation? Okay. Oh? I really don't want to be near that thing. Hope that it takes the other way around. God, that thing is so fucked up. It's got a face on it. Jesus. Gotta continue to follow it because everything's locked down. Yeah, I made Moff a mod so that way uh, we could deal with some stuff. Because hoarding all of the mod power to myself seems to have been um, a problem. And Moff is always here anyway, so. He's a cool dude. Blame acres. That's probably true. At five, I'm gonna pause for a minute. I might stop and restart the stream. And the reason is that um, normally I'd have to go at five in order to make it where I need to go. I need to get to class, but class is gonna be at eight today instead. Really hoping that he just fucks off. So there might be an extension to stream. careful with using the flashlight he notices it more than you think okay I know he notices me turning it on because it's really fucking loud I didn't really do an application process I just sort of asked Mafa during like Sunday's stream so I'll have to go at 8 but I also do need to do some homework so I don't know If I can, I will, but I may not be able to. So I'm not promising anything, but I should probably get caught up on some of that homework I was talking about earlier that's like, I'm behind on. Oh God. I didn't ask me. Oh, whoops. Would you like to be a mod then? Okay. a little bit. We can't really go anywhere right now anyway. Oh, well, close. Uh, I don't know what you've missed. I don't know when you left. Uh, we're still trying to do the same thing. Uh, 
I'm sorry, Swin. I don't want to do it just because people are you know, subbed or whatever, because that seems like a really bad way of doing mods, but Mafa has been around for fucking ever. Uh, but so is Swin and Sparty, I don't know. I'm awful. I'm just an asshole. That's what it is. That's my modding process. I'm an asshole and I have no idea what I'm doing. Okay. Oh, okay, that made it. Okay, good, good. Yeah. Okay. What did... How did he not hear that? Did he? Yeah, like, half of the people who have subscribed to me have subscribed to me for, like, months. So... Oh... Right? Okay, that's how this works. I've got to pump it a lot. You hate the screechy sound the monster keeps making. Okay. Why is this the way that I have to bilge the pump? Sounds very close. Yeah, he is. Which way is he coming? Okay, he's turning. Good. Am I spooked yet? Yeah, actually. Okay. Let me get to the next save point, then I'll check and see if I've got more time or not. The flashlight is actually just kind of flashing because I think there's a flashlight going and then there's also that. Okay. What did I do? What did I just do? Aside from piss off the monster, what did I achieve there? There are a lot of robots running around that think they're human. Yeah, that's a thing, too. Um. What the fuck does this do? Powered the shuttle room. That makes sense. Okay. I don't remember where the fuck that was. Oh, that door that I was just near that was locked. Okay. Are you spooked yet? Yeah. Spookage is happening. OK. 
Okay, he's right there. As long as he just keeps going the direction he's supposed to go in his little route. Alright, um... Wow, um, on a list of things that I want to do, jumping into this water's pretty fucking low, but, um... It doesn't seem like I have a whole lot of great choices. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to aim for that ladder. I think that's where I want to go. There's so much going on in this room. Um, it's lagging a bit. Oh, there we go. Okay, here we go. There's something most definitely in the water with me. I can almost guarantee that. <sighs> This game is starting to get kind of stressful. I don't care to look around too much. sure what I'm trying to get. Now I can get to a lot of different places. It's just one of them is actually where I'm trying to go. I don't know. I'm going to stream Amnesia after I beat this. I'm not swaying. That's either my character or that's the platform. It's really unsettling. I'm getting down. I do have dainty hands. I literally have a woman's body. It's a long story. But, long story short, um, I am a dude from the past. Artificially put! Into the uh, body of a... woman from the future who is now in the present, but technically speaking, I'm a robot. Not actually a man, or a woman, but I'm kind of a woman, but mostly a dude's mind put inside... Ah, oh, fuck. A dude's mind put in the side... A robot put inside a woman. How do I know that I'm inside the woman's body? Uh, it told me a minute ago. So that's... The woman part is dead, yeah. But I needed a body, so... Um... Okay. Alright, we just gotta go around. It's a weird puzzle. Okay. I can't really jump to any real effect down here. And it's almost impossible to see. There's no brain, yeah. The woman that I scanned doesn't seem too... Or that's been helping me doesn't seem too weirded out about the fact that I'm inside her friend's body. Um, I'm literally a robot head on a woman's body. Oh, okay, that would explain why I had uh, glowing eyes at that one part. Um... How do I get from a robot into a woman's body? I don't know. See, that part, they still haven't explained. I just sort of woke up after going in for a brain scan. Now I'm, uh... 
Yeah. I don't know, it's a weird game. Actually, if you guys don't mind, uh... Uh, give me a half second. I know it's like every hour. Um, but I've trained my body to go to the bathroom every hour. And I want to check and see if Tilda is still asleep. And if she is, I'll keep streaming. How's that sound? I'll be right back. Two minutes this time? A little extra time? I'll be right back. I just muted myself, so I was explaining how I was going to play a different song. But anyway, I'm, I'll be right back. This is an this is some kind of shit song, isn't it? Doesn't really work. Sorry, I probably should have put the uh, ad break on for longer than I did. I'm gonna turn this song off because it's annoying me. Um. Oh hi. Hold on one second. All right, I'm back. Just checking on Tilda. She just woke up. Um, I don't know if we'll be going a whole lot longer. Why don't we uh, get to the next checkpoint? I need to probably work on homework anyway. So a little bit of extra stream. Ooh, that's freaking me out. Sorry, hold on. Alright, going up that ladder, di ladder didn't help me any, so we're just going to go across this thing. Um. Yeah, I s my brain was scanned for the sake of just, you know, learning stuff about my brain and maybe being able to help me with the car crash thing that I had going on. Oh, God. Um... I think this is right. Oh, don't do that. 
Am I trying to get through that door? Can I take that drop drop without dying? Probably not. Tilda has found it hilarious this month to randomly come up beside me while I'm streaming and poke me in the side and say boo. Um, how far into the game is this? Uh, on rev speed, it's six hours. On a normal person's speed, probably half that. Okay. And then... I don't know how that hurt me, but... That was less of a jump. I think that's what I was supposed to do. That feels right. Turn off the light, it's not doing any favors right now. Okay. I don't see too, seem to be too banged up, so it's just gonna oh okay I uh, jumped down one of them with the water I figured it wasn't gonna be long before he caught up to me so I just figured I'd run for it but I just ended up running into a tube hopefully this doesn't kill me it probably won't but, you know. Oh, good. Someone else tried that and it didn't work out for them. Um, I killed the dream I dreamed, it says. I like how I'm still breathing, even though I have no need to breathe. Alright, well, there's the next save point. Um, I think that's where we'll, where we'll stop. Um, that's a good stopping point. We got away from the monster, that one particular type of proxy. Um... Oh, oh, oh. Let's go ahead and check the art. Um, I am, but my head is uh, a brain or a robot, not an actual body. So, um, yeah. It's sort of like... Um, my head has, or the female's head has just been replaced with a robot, and that robot is, uh, my, my, my brain from the past. Anyway, let me, uh, let me check the art real quick. Um, eventually the Olaf emote will be ready, and then, as well, there'll be the Yol emote, uh, or the combination emote with Yol, but I need, need to work that out with Bretotop, who's doing the Olaf emote. I gotta check. Let me see if it works now. Whoops. Uh, no. It does not work yet. Okay. Oh well. For subscribers, that'll be a, an emote eventually. Um, hopefully. Unless if it gets kicked back for whatever reason. It's bootleg Olaf. Um, I think Yol had some problems with Skeletor before. Right? <sighs> I'm tired. I don't know why. Probably just didn't sleep well. I should probably catch some food. That might help.
That was a that was a good amount of time. You got friends here, Marks. You just be friends by being friendly person, you know. Be nice to people and assuming they're not assholes, you'll be friends with them as well. It's just kind of how it goes. We've got one art. Uh, I just wanted to contribute to you and Vinny. I have absolutely no idea what the fuck this is that it's referencing. Um, I'll look at it. Oh, it's something that... What? Okay, Goomba Fan 333 makes this in reference to... Or maybe Steffos? It's attributed to both for some reason. I don't know. Uh, it's uploaded by Goomba Fan 333. Um, and it's referencing me, Vinny, and Snake, and Metal Gear. I have not been catching Vinny's streams. They're always at a time that's just like totally not a time I can do. Um, so let me get it so you guys can see it. Um, that would be ideal. Also, I should mention, I'm going to PAX South. If you want to go and you want to meet me and KY and possibly Carrie and Tilda, we will be there on Saturday. Uh, I don't know what day that is. It's only a three-day thing, so you should be able to figure it out. Um, but I'll be on that Saturday, whatever that day that is. Anyway, um, it's of uh, me and Vinny, and I'm saying, I am not a snail. I am not a snail. Rev, you aren't getting out of this. I'm still going to shoot you. Does anyone have any idea what the fuck this is? Um, I don't know what it is. Um, that's, it's, okay. Anyway, uh, that's where we're going to end the stream. Um, on that note of me being confused. That sounds about right. I don't know, the whole idea of the, the main protagonist being a 27 year old guy who was in a car wreck is like that's something I can like identify with I'm 27 I'm a dude I've been in car wrecks before had to do MRIs and that kind of shit so maybe that's why it hits a little closer to home he acts the way I would act um, but he's fairly blank slate it's a good game really um I'm going to play I Am the Black Mages because whatever. It's Metal Gear Solid Five. Um, I just don't know what part of it he's referencing. But I will see you guys later. Um, thank you guys for watching. Sorry I didn't make the stream go on longer, but I need to get some work done. And um, it went on a little longer than usual. So I'll see you guys next time. And that'll be Saturday. See you then. Bye.